in this problem of course just by seeing this it is uh, network theory transformers it is not machine transform because he is trying to play and next thing here is they have chosen numbers in such a way they have chosen numbers in such a way immediately after solving this problem you will understand means question will become so simple they asked v naught v naught is the voltage across 8 ohm resistance okay so it is actually very simple problem just by calculating only one equation will be able to get the answer okay but if i change means in the next problem i am going to change this 8 ohms to 5 ohms then problem length of the problem will be too much increased okay so definitely this can come in gate for sure okay so point here is means if i have on primary or first coil let me drop it here okay so if i think of in first coil if i get one turn one is to two i got how many turns here in the secondary two two turns so if i think of voltage induced here is v1 voltage induced here is v2 v2 number of turns here is going to be double okay so number of turns are double but emf per turn or voltage per turn is going to be same so number of turns are more voltage will be more okay so this is going to be kind of hv this is going to be kind of lv low voltage side high voltage side we can think of okay if this dot is positive this dot is going to be positive done right so if this dot is positive at any instant this dot is going to be positive okay now if current entering here is i1 okay if current is entering into dot current should leave from the dot okay so current should leave from the dot okay directly in this sense if i follow this if i1 is positive i2 is going to become positive okay they can ask a question i2 you please calculate in this direction also they can ask under that condition negative term will come it's pure mathematics we will see in some other problems okay see here in this case i1 is entering i2 is leaving problem solved so one is to two this is hv side high voltage side less current will be there low voltage side high current will be there okay in our discussion we have done the same so here i1 i1 equal to two times i2 okay because we have seen v1 by v2 equal to n1 by n2 equal to i2 by i1 i2 by i1 so see here this is i1 this is i2 so i1 magnitude should be two times i2 two times i2 because means very simple here high voltage side voltage will be high low voltage side current will be high then power will be same okay so i1 magnitude should be more because it is low voltage i2 magnitude should be less because it is high voltage now we can solve the problem that's it so if i think of current leaving here is some ix same current should come here of ix so ix minus i2 will go here then okay now let us apply kvl around this let us apply kvl around this problem will be solved so if i apply kvl minus 240 or if i send it to the other side it's going to plus 240 and here current entering here is going to be i1 plus ix so current here is i1 plus ix so 4 i1 plus ix plus 8 ix just a minute yeah this is better so 4 let me write it again okay so 4 oh sorry 4 i1 plus ix plus 8 ix plus 8 ix minus i2 equal to 240 equal to 240 now already you know i1 value is 2i2 so 4 into 2i2 8i2 plus 4ix plus 8ix plus 8ix minus 8i2 equal to 240 so 8i2 8i2 will be cancelled so 8 8 16 16 plus 4 20 so 240 by 20 so ix is going to be 12 amperes 240 by 20 12 amperes okay so if ix is 12 amperes how much is the voltage here voltage plus is there at the entry point of the current only so 8 into ix 8 into 12 so v naught equal to 8 into 12 is going to be 96 volts okay now let me take the same problem and let me change this 
just I'm going I means I changed from 8 ohms to 5 ohms now let us uh, see the complexity level okay same question same question everything is same okay yeah, as usual whatever the way we calculate say uh, previously the same way let us proceed so this is v1 this is v2 so two times so v2 equal to two times v1 okay this dot is plus whenever this dot is plus this dot is going to plus okay now current is entering into the dot of i1 so current should leave from the dot of i2 okay and this is lv side lv side voltage will be less current will be more so i1 equal to 2 i2 problem solved okay now let us write try to write the equation okay so let us try to write this equation you will not be able to solve okay three equations will come let us see okay so minus 240 or 240 equal to current flowing here is i1 plus ix if i consider this as ix as usual this is ix so this is ix and this is going to be ix minus i2 ix minus i2 okay now if i try to write the equation minus 240 or 240 equal to 4 into ix plus i1 plus 8 ix plus 5 into ix minus i2 equal to 240 equal to 240 okay now 4 ix yeah 4 ix plus i1 equal to 2 i2 so 8 i2 plus 8 ix plus 5 ix minus 5 i2 equal to 240 okay now 8 i2 8 i2 will not be cancelled that's why length of the problem will be more anyway see here 4 8 12 plus 5 17 ix so 17 ix 8 minus 5 3 so plus 3 i2 equal to 240 this is the first equation okay after that try to write equation kvl here try to write kvl here so three equations will come let us see let us see okay so yes okay so let me write one equation here of this or of this anything so see here 5 into ix minus i2 so 5 into ix minus i2 okay in this direction plus v2 plus v2 okay minus 2 i2 because current is coming in this direction i2 plus will come here minus will come here in applying k will i'm going to touch minus first so minus 2 i2 equal to 0 okay so 5 ix minus 5 i2 plus v2 equal to 2v1 2v1 okay 5 ix minus 5 i2 plus v2 2v1 minus 2 i2 equal to 0 so minus 5 minus 2 minus 7 so 5 ix plus 2v1 minus 5 ix minus 5 minus 5 i2 minus 7 i2 equal to 0 is the second equation second equation now let me solve third equation okay so let me solve third equation so if i write to write try to write kvl around this kvl around this it's going to minus 240 or 240 equal to 4 into ix plus i1 plus v1 equal to 240 okay so 4 ix plus 4 i1 i1 is nothing but 2 i2 so 8 i2 plus v1 equal to 0 this is the third equation okay so these three equations has to be solved okay so these three equations has to be solved if you solve these three of course this question cannot come in gate okay so this question cannot come in gate uh -huh. i hope it's visible now okay so this question cannot come in gate because three equations have to be solved in the exam that too by using virtual calculator is difficult okay so that's why simple logic here is they have given question in such a way that they have given eight ohms such that this and this will get cancelled automatically question is so simple but if that eight ohm has been replaced with five ohm under that condition length of the question is going to be increased okay let's take another problem